Hi, it's me again with Corel Roll Tips and Tricks. Somebody sent me this and they're having trouble with the envelope tool. And I've done it without the envelope tool. Well, there's a couple of things I would change now. But they can't get the envelope tool to work. And I know the reason. If we go to envelope and press shape, the object you selected is invalid. Try again. So one of the objects is bad. So this object is a common shape. They drew it with the basic shapes for common shape. Go to object and convert it to a curve. We'll see if it'll work now. And it works, but it's all messed up. So let's go vertical. It's hard to do something. That's not bad. And you could actually, I actually did that from this. But what you want to do is uh, go EC and put them inside there. Ooh, what happened there? Oh, I grabbed the other family. I grabbed the other part of the F. So now let's grab both. Well, uh, let's put it over here. I'm going to go EC and put it on top of there. Now I've got my, I set my nudge factor on 15. Move that out of the way. Take this, and I always think it's better to look at it in not wireframe, but a hairline. And then you need to convert this to a curve so you can move some nodes. And then move your heart back. And then just, this is where your artistic ability will come into play. Now that we got nodes, you know, you know what we could do is take the heart See, down here, we got a heart on a hairline. Let's go to object and lock it. Now we can't grab the heart and we can move the F around. So you just want to just kind of, you know, use your imagination in what it's going to look like. And you're using the red for a, in, in the, the previous one I did, I did not extend the, and I'm going past the heart because we're going to uh, smart fill this in. And I want it to go all the way to the heart edge. And then like here, I'm going to bring this up. Doesn't matter where you put it. I actually put this up. Kind of make it look the same. I think the bottom is good. So now what we're going to do, I think we got it. Um, let's unlock the heart. And we can try... to, because this is still one group, we can try, let's try this. I did not try this earlier, intersect. And it worked. Then you could just take this and go black. Take away the outline. It looks like a heart, but you could always nudge your heart back over. Make it black by right clicking and make it something other than a hairline. Just so it'll stand out a little bit. And just remember if you're ever doing this, that doesn't look too bad. I would always scale it to object because it is a line and then group that together. That's not bad. Uh, matter of fact, that looks pretty good. I like the, the part of the end that goes into the bottom of the heart and you can, you can definitely read it. So that's why the envelope tool wouldn't work. And if, if I could not have, um, uh, intersected it, I was going to just take the smart fill tool and fill it in. Then you can take this object and move it out of the way. And you've got the same, same exact. Now see, without the outline, it doesn't really look like a heart. Well, it's because we haven't trimmed the F with a, yeah. So it probably does. Anyway, I hope that helped them a little bit. Thank you for watching.